Greetings to everyone. Welcome back to NKC Spotlight. This time we are back with a jolly mood and cozy feeling because it's the Christmas season. As the season of goodwill proceeds, we will dive back to those good old memories of this festival as we ask our special guest their wholesome memories of the season. Welcome Mr. Edwin Mathias to our podcast for the very first time. Sir, it's a pleasure to have you here with us for NKC special episode. Thank you for the kind words. Thank you for the introduction. I am very happy to be here. So my first question is, what is your fondest Christmas memory? Well, uh, my fondest Christmas memory has a lot to do uh, with why I chose not to wear anything Christmassy. When I heard I were you were doing this, of course, first of all, thank you for having me. Uh, but this led to a, uh, my wardrobe uh, crisis because I was trying to look for something green or red or something Christmassy. And uh, my red shirts don't fit me anymore. But uh, and part of the reason is right from childhood, my favorite fondest memory has been, I think what also happens during Diwali, that's the distribution of sweets. You know, uh, on Christmas Day, you go with the plate, you go, you wish your neighbors. And of course, you give them the sweets and you eagerly wait to see what you're getting in return. So that has been my fondest memory of Christmas, sweets. So my next question is, so do you have any funny anecdotes to share? Uh, I do not know how funny it would be since uh, I guess you ha had to have been there in such a situation. But essentially, I had a friend who would always come during evening time or during lunch time. And whenever I would insist that, you know, uh, listen, will you have something? Uh, I was in school at that time and he would always decline. And uh, since uh, it took me a while to learn manners, I would shamelessly eat in front of him while he was sitting there. Then one day it so happened during Christmas, he came and I said, listen, will you eat something? There is this, there is that, and there are these sweets or whatever. And I was uh, speaking to him with my back towards him. And apparently he said, okay, I'll have a little which I never heard. So I thought, Fir se na bola hoga. So I happily went and sat and I began eating and eating and eating and he was just staring at me. And then after some time he said, Edwin, I said, I'll have a little. So again, you know, <clears throat> the reason for this. All right. So lastly, which is that one holiday destination that brings you the most joy? Holiday destination. I think, you know, uh, wherever you are with your friends, I mean, you mean like a trip or whatever, I think uh, either with your friends or with your family, of course, it depends. Uh, some destinations you wouldn't go with your family and vice versa. But I think as long as all your friends are there and maybe you students uh, perhaps don't experience this, but I think all the other adults listening would agree with me. You know, as time passes and you start working, it becomes really difficult to get the whole gang together. And when the whole gang gets together, you know, uh, especially for Christmas, because there are holidays in between, honestly, the destination doesn't matter as long as uh, everyone has made it. So true, sir. It, it actually doesn't matter when you are with your favorite people. You actually tend to forget everything. Sir, it's a great feeling hearing from your own professor about how they celebrated all these festivals and about their experiences. Sir, we are so, so honored to have you on this special episode of NKC Spotlight, which is Christmas episode. Sir, thank you so much. You're more than welcome because the pleasure is all mine. It was very sweet of you, all of you to think uh, and invite me for this. And uh, thank you for the questions. I think they were fun to answer. So thank you. So this was our special Christmas NKC episode. As the year ends, we want to thank each one of you for your support and walking with us on this journey. We will now directly meet you in 2024. But guess what? We have a lot in store. Stay tuned for that and Merry Christmas!